Christine W here in the M&M's Interview Lounge. Welcome to K2 Euphoria. Yay. Yay. I'm so excited. My face is on an M&M. I can't even handle it right now. That's I'm what so I was going to ask you about. So they custom made you in this, like, I guess it's a champagne glass. It's in a champagne bottle, which I love champagne. So I don't know how they pulled all this off. And also M&M's are small. So they, like, were able to print your face. That was amazing. And your name. That no, is we've been so taking cool. pictures of it for the last two hours. Oh, yeah. yeah I would them totally. To everybody totally. I <laughs> it's so like a, I think, you know. We've I mean, made it. besides the 17 know. number ones, like that's how you know you've made it when yeah. your face is on an M&M. &M. There it is. We're doing it, Wendy. Yeah. So how does it feel to be at K2 for you? It's awesome. Like we, we go back a long way and I've loved this station forever. And um, I heard my song for the first time on the radio <gasps> at KTU. Oh my gosh! That wait. Makes me get so wait, wait. Oh no! <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh. I just did my makeup. Stop. Yes. Wait, wait. So when was that? When, when 90, was that? Ninety-seven. Oh. Yeah. You may. Oh. We sorry. Can't. <laughs> this is a happy lounge here. Yeah. This, I mean, this. These yeah, are all happy. amazing memories. Happy memories. Yeah. Wow. You know, it's a good. It's a good misty eye. <laughs> I know. And by the way, we have to say thank you because uh, it was yesterday you were promoting our show. Always. On Good Day New York with yes. and Rosanna Scotto literally lost her breath dancing as you were performing. We all did. Even <laughs> Isaac, he's like in the best shape of anybody on the planet, and he looked over. I said, "You're kind of breathing heavy for a workout, man." <laughs> <laughs> it was a good warm up to the show. I think that the fans really have something in store for them tonight. So uh, we've we've brought a lot. We brought the whole Vegas show here. So oh, okay. yeah, you're not All ready. Right. You're not ready for this one. It's it's a good one. It's it, a good one. Well, one thing that I personally always wanted to know is that you started off as like a pageant person. Like, yeah. was this like this whole thing? Always part of the plan to be a big global Absolutely superstar? Absolutely not. No, no. My dad wanted me to be in journalism. He wanted me to have a talk show host. He was obsessed with um, uh, Diane Sawyer. He was in love with her, and he wanted me to be the, you know, Diane Sawyer type, you know. So I graduated from college, actually. I minored with music. My stepdad, who I uh, uh, dedicated the Land of the Living album to, He's, he was just, he really wanted me to be a broadcast journalist. So that's what my degree is in. But I minored in music because I knew, hey, I'm going to do music. But he was, my mom, who was a musician, she didn't even want me to be a musician. So, um, but they really couldn't when stop When is the everybody going to support the arts, guys? It is an actual career. Yeah, well, no, my mom was a, a she was a nightclub performer six nights a week. Wow. And, and so she knew the life and she... She so it's a really hard, hard life. And I said, I'm going to have a big show. I'm going to Vegas. I'm going to have a big show. You know what I mean? That big, that big Vegas show paid for the horse ranch, right? And it sure did. So, yeah. <laughs> yeah it's a good thing saying. we did that. So, yeah, yeah. That's fantastic. Yeah. So what is your favorite song to perform for the fans? Um, I think Feel What You Want has a lot of memories. But honestly, I would say uh, probably Land of the Living. Because all of us in New York and, um, you know, in this, this state, there's so many people that I love here. And... We've all survived. We're in the land of the living, and there's a lot of show people here, a lot of show people in Las Vegas, yeah. and the song's really about surviving the business, and you're in the business, show business. It ain't easy, friends. Oh, it's not. <laughs> um, to be alive, we've survived yeah. in the land of the living, right? Yes, and, you know, we're, we're here. It is Pride Month. We are very proud to, um, to, to be here and to have a really um, – big lineup that is, you know, has a huge, uh, huge LGBTQ following, right? Like a lot of your fans. Would you say that your songwriting has been like catered to the community at all? Or is it just kind of organic? It's just, it just happens. I've never, you know, intentionally said, oh, here, I'm going to write a gay song, you know, you, you, about gay people. But no, no, it's just being in clubs in the LGBT community and just being there with them, for them. They've inspired so many messages, which are basically that's the, the same thing everybody's feeling, straight, gay, whatever, you know, uh, let me in, you know. I mean, we're all trying to g gain acceptance, you know, and um, songs like One More Try, we've all uh, graduated from high school, went back to our hometown and said, wow, it's, I don't fit in here anymore. Like, everybody is gone. Everything's changed. Oh, just, you know, time be my teacher, you know, give me one more try at it. But but you can't, you got to keep moving. Songs like Can't Look Back yeah, on the new album. Say. Yeah. I think everybody can relate to that one. Yeah, I can't look like, back. We're we not going that way. We all went through a way. pandemic. It's yes. like nobody wants to look back. We all want to look forward exactly. and keep it positive. Exactly. And, and by my side is Celebrates Friendships, like the, yeah, the beautiful just people. Out, like, what, that just came out to, like days or yeah, now. <laughs> right now. Right now. Right now. <laughs> Uh, I saw the lyric video. Congratulations. Thank you. We were going to do the, the real the official video when we get back to Vegas. We just put all of our energies into this show for this night for KTU because we love the station. I love the station. We love the station. Everybody loves the station. So we wanted to do something really epic and 
beautiful for so, you guys. Thank you. Yeah. Are you gonna? Is this gonna be the first time you perform this live on stage? It is the first time. Wow. My new song. You guys heard it here first. <laughs> so we're a little bit. We're a little bit. Ah! But uh, it was good. We had a great run through, and uh, we have a great choreographer that choreographed it, Jamie Hosick. She. She's a great choreographer. And um, Jeffrey, our stylist, he st styled this whole show. We, all of us, you know, did a team effort. So you'll see everything was done just for tonight when you see the costuming and the show and just the way we've woven everything. And fantastic videography from uh, the boys in Palm Springs, Brad, uh, Bernier, Don Lamb. There's, there's a lot of people involved in making this a really epic night, special night. That's and Bartel's here. I know. You guys go back a we long We go back way, a long yeah. way. So he's been by my side yeah. for a long time. And people like Roberto Novo and Sean Pinkerton, who's here, and my dancers, they've been with me through a lot. We've done a lot of shows together. And so and I'm making more new friends. I know. Yeah, I which like we're besties really, now. And I, I like, know. I Wendy, know. let's go. <laughs> Do you need a backup dancer? Oh, hey, you've got some moves. Get out there tonight. We're yes. all about it. We are yeah. so excited to have you. Thank you. And thank you for stopping by. I know it's like kind of hectic before show, before the performance, but Eminem's Interview Lounge, we're just so excited yeah. to have you here at Well, KT thank you for you. having me. And uh, yeah, my hair probably won't be as nice as it looks now. After Girl, we, it's the beach. After we shred it there. It's the beach. <laughs> it's the beach. <laughs> so I love you, KT. I love you, New York. And thank you for being my let me be a part of this epic night. It's going to be magical. Yes. Hey, we got to do a hug. I need a hug. Oh! Yes. Yes. Oh, I love you, too, man.